Hey guys, it's Nicole from ConvertKit. Today I'm going to walk you through how to add a custom header to your email template. So the first thing you want to do is create a custom email template. Um, the way we recommend to do this is to click into your favorite template. Um, today I'm going to choose the text only. Then select all the code, copy, create a new template, and paste. Um, so this basically gives you a framework for a well-structured email. Um, you don't have to worry about breaking any code or trying to build it from scratch. You can use this as a framework. So I'm gonna name this custom header and I'm gonna save it. Then um, you're gonna upload your image to a broadcast draft. So what we recommend is you create a new draft, you name it media upload, um, do not send if you like, um, just whatever is gonna help you realize that this is where your images are kept. And you can set it to send to zero subscribers by selecting matching none and all subscribers. So now it's not gonna accidentally go out to anybody. Then you're gonna insert your image into the email. So you can use our image um, inserter right here. Just choose your file and upload to the email. Once it's here, um, head over to the HTML editor of the email and you're actually just gonna grab this image code right here. You don't need the um, P tags, but you wanna get the full image code here. And we're gonna copy that, and then we're gonna head back to our email template. All right, so now I'm just gonna paste that image code that I grabbed from the email right here, right in the div class of message content and right above the message content. Then I'm just gonna click preview and make sure it looks good. And that's it. So now, once I save this, I'll be able to use this template for my emails. So let's say I'm setting out a broadcast and I like all my broadcasts to have my header at the top. Um, I'm just gonna go in and edit the content. And then select the template from the side. And just to make sure it worked, you can see it automatically adds my template right there, or my um, header right there. So that's it, that's how you add a custom header to your email. If you have any further questions, um, you can always reach out to um, support at convertkit.com.